David Domani has been a regular fixture on primetime television for decades, offering his expert gardening advice on shows including This Morning, 60 Minute Makeover, The Alan Titchmarsh Show and, most famously, ITV's Love Your Garden. Co-hosting the show alongside his pal Alan, 74 as well as co-presenters Katie Rushworth, 40, and Francis Tophill, 35 David has helped create 120 episodes transforming gardens across the UK. Still a firm favorite among fans after 13 years on air, David says of its success. I think many people are seeing that gardening is much more than weeding and watering and cutting the lawn. It's a chill-out zone. It's a chance to recharge the batteries and bring a bit of sanity back to a crazy world. It's not all plain sailing for the 61-year-old, though, and he opened up to Express.co.uk about the jeopardy he and Alan find themselves in during filming. He said at the Ideal Home Show, it's not like the interior designers, they have got it made. Inside, nonchalantly leaning on the fridge with a cappuccino and a cake hole full of Kit Kat. And we're outside in the wind and rain. On one episode, I said to Alan, we are soaked through tar pants. I'm looking at him and he is looking at me, and we've still got a garden to build. If we were TV chefs, we would be having a glass of wine in a warm kitchen with a cupcake. Instead, we've got another eight hours. Are we going to finish? That's the real jeopardy of dealing with living products. But I've got to say, if I'm outside and it's raining, windy and cold, as long as I can see the sun up there and hear the birds, I take that any day compared to being in a windowless room. Outside of his TV work, David has won some of the most prestigious awards in his field including 30 Royal Horticultural Society medals and Prince Edward's Award for Excellence in Horticultural Career Development. As for the biggest tip he would give gardeners this spring, he pleads, just have a go. Just have a go, whether you are an expert gardener or a novice, at growing one thing from seed. My first experience with gardening was when I was at school. It was an experiment and you put a bean in a jam jar pressed against the side, you put soil in the middle and you can see it germinate. There was that magic that you have had a part of something that has come to life. I've been a professional horticulturist for 45 years, and I still get that same excitement.